India has about 40% of its population who are very young. So that would be around 400 million. So these children are in schools in various grades. So we need to make sure they're all learning. The World Report says that by 2020, India will have the youngest population. We need to make sure that's an educated, qualified population that we have. ILP stands for India Literacy Project. ILP is basically enabling children to get access, enrollment, retention to schools, which is their fundamental right through the government system. Lodi Garden, it is located in Delhi. That's what ILP does. So I work with the community, work with the government, make sure the schools are all functioning and children are learning well in these schools. Who is the first ruler of Gilji Dynasty? Google Earth turned out to be a great tool for us to teach. There was a recent survey that was done um, nationally and it was found that 42% of the children could show on a map the state where they lived. What the teachers love about this is this is the most interactive class they have because they put it up there and then if it's a Taj Mahal, the kid is able to walk through Taj Mahal and all the kids go, wow. My name is Dayavati and I'm studying architecture currently and I'm a local guide here in Delhi. I think it's great being able to connect people, share what we are feeling, what we are experiencing moving through these spaces and other people are able to experience it. Monuments are the remnants of who we are and how we thought and how we lived. So I think it's really important for future young generations to know how it all started. A lot of the students asking me after the class also, uh, ma'am, I want to go to that place, so kindly please uh, sit with me and teach me how to go. They loved smart classrooms. We are enjoyingly learning this. Seeing that uh, fun videos is very interesting. School is about building a curiosity for learning and a love for learning that will last a lifetime.